The last few years have been a time of tremendous growth all around the world for Munich-based fleet logistics, and the growth continues with a new Singapore hub and plans to move into South America very soon. We had a tremendous growth uh, in, uh, in 2013, 2014, 2015, and uh, we are continuing to, to grow rapidly. Um, we uh, went into new countries also outside uh, uh, Europe and uh, we are happy to announce that uh, we have uh, started up uh, in uh, Singapore with uh, 11 new countries working from, from our Singapore hub. Uh, also go into to, to Brazil next uh, the, the, the next time uh, to be represented with uh, a high coverage in, in, in Southern America from, from a hub in, 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 in Sao Paulo. Uh, in, in general, we, we are following uh, the, the footprint of, uh, of our customers. Um, our customers do expect from a, let me say, neutral uh, a player in, 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 in the fleet management market, uh, a high presence uh, in, in, in the markets where we're there, uh, active. Um, so um, we uh, do provide, uh, I uh, think, uh, one of the most completed uh, uh, programs uh, uh, also, outside, also outside Europe. In 2015, in 2015, we have uh, purchased 100% uh, of the shares from TCO Plus and uh, Fleet Vision uh, to complete our, our program. Uh, and uh, what I uh, can uh, pick up from the markets is uh, that we achieved we achieved a completed value chain. Now we're starting up our program with. Um, uh, consulting services, uh, supporting, uh, supporting the, the face uh, in uh, 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 finding uh, the right strategic approach for our customers. The customer is uh, usually 70%, 70 percent, I have to say, of our customers are American companies. So this is very important for us, even if we concentrate in majority our activities more on the fleets outside the United States.